With summer in full swing, the Tourism Bureau is pulling out all the stops to boost international tourism back to pre-pandemic levels by 2024. Now they're showcasing a summer tourism festival which features 35 activities for travelers and will even be broadcasting a promotional video in New York's Times Square starting next month. Let's hear about what's in store. Visit Taidong's Luye Highland and sail into the sky in a colorful hot air balloon. Or head to Alishan to beat the heat and enjoy the best of Taiwan's tea. Peak summer travel season is just around the corner, and the Tourism Bureau is organizing a festival to promote 35 summer tourism activities. To beckon international tourists to the island, They'll even be showing a promotional video in New York City's Times Square. We're currently working with the Qibuling Foundation to film some scenes for the Summer Tourism Festival video, including some of the activities. It will be broadcasted in Times Square in the U.S. As we all know, content in Times Square can be seen by the whole world. Through international marketing, we invite the world to travel to Taiwan. Currently, most of the tourists visiting Taiwan are from Japan, Korea, and Southeast Asia. The Tourism Bureau's video will be shown from July to the end of August and aims to attract more tourists from North America. Their goal is to surpass 100,000 visitors from the region and bring international tourism back to pre-pandemic levels. We're working hard to bring in international tourists. The day before yesterday, we reached 2.46 million visitors, with a goal of 6 million by the end of the year. We are now sure that that goal will be reached and that we can reach 12 million next year, which was the pre-pandemic level. The transport minister stressed that local tourism in Taiwan is concentrated on weekends and holidays. He hopes that international visitors can help boost weekday travel and power up Taiwan's tourism market.